What's up everybody? My name's Yian Jones, I'm the founder of Smoking Barrels uh, and today we are going to Cotswold Field Sports Simulated Day. So they run a day where you can go do your simulated day as normal and you can take a dog with you as a peg dog or you can go as a picker up and you have two options. The pickers up stand with their dogs at the uh, back of the drive, they wait for the kind of guns to finish shooting and then Cotswold's gun dogs uh, throw out a bunch of dummies, let the dogs go and retrieve and then you can also take a dog with you on the peg, get the dog to sit nicely on the peg and they've got the gun dog trainers there which is really really awesome. I think it's a really good segue into the field sports world and game shooting world if you haven't done a lot of that before. Um, I love the idea and the very generous guys invited me down to go do some shooting, bring the dogs down. So me and Heather are going to head down there, we're going to film the whole day for you, hopefully have a whole lot of fun. See you in a bit. And we have arrived, so we made it here eventually. We had to do a bit of uh, transitioning down some bumpy tracks and we brought the car instead of the truck, so that was a bit of a mistake. But we uh, yeah, we made it in the end. Dogs are ready to go. We've got everyone here, all their dogs ready to go. I think there's more people picking up than there is shooting, uh, which will be a bit of fun. Um, but hopefully, it should be a good day. We're gonna get into it now. I look out across the water I smell the song I feel the breeze But in my heart I hear the call Of my old home Tennessee So we just had our team brief from the guy who uh, runs this place. He's um, kind of told everyone this is all about the dogs. We're doing this some training sessions first before we start the shooting. But yeah, really good for people who haven't been out on their first kind of day shooting yet. Um, haven't really done a lot of game days. Um, so I really like the idea and the atmosphere and he's kind of gone over how it's, expect mistakes to be made. This is kind of relaxed. It shouldn't be kind of scared and nervous. Um, and it's just allowing people to actually take part and have fun. So I think this should be a really good day. And we're gonna go do some training now as the first part. We just have to have a nice drive through the countryside. And we're off. So we've had our little brief, we've had the safety brief, uh, and then we've had some kind of dog training briefs and we're taking all the people who haven't done a lot of game shooting through the kind of process, where the pickers up stand, where the guns stand, and etiquette stuff, uh, all about bringing your gun out the slip and everything, the whole way, <laughs> whole way from bottom to top. Uh, so now we're waiting because it's about 20, you can see everyone behind me, it's kind of 25, 26 degrees. So the people are getting pretty hot. So the, the dogs are just having a chill under the shade. Uh, we're just over here, just waiting. As soon as they've got the trap set up, we're gonna start drive one, um, which should be really, really good fun. I'm looking forward to it. So they're gonna have all the pickers up stood kind of the back of this field, I don't know if you can see, back over here. Uh, and then the guns are gonna be right at the front and we're gonna have the peg dogs sat with the guns. They're gonna shoot. They'll throw all the dummies out around the peg dogs, making sure they're kind of steady. That's the main aim is just to keep the dogs steady, not going and retrieving when you haven't told them to. Uh, and then we'll have all of the pickers up at the back of the field and they'll be throwing dummies out kind of a lot further away and they're gonna be trying to send the dogs out retrieve come back um, and they're going to try and obviously keep them steady whilst the drive's going on so teaching etiquette teaching the dogs kind of teaching everything sounds like a good day uh, we'll get into it now we're off Ooh, we're off people are moving i'm out See ya. Okay. 
so we're taking it up a notch each time so this time as we're shooting the clays they're going to throw the kind of throw the dummies out at the same time try and wind the dogs up a bit more a bit more realistic more like the birds are actually dropping um so it's all about just keeping the dog, dog steady on the drive again um hopefully I'll have, a, I'll have just as much fun as the last time I went through almost two boxes there that was only like the first test up drive so I'm going to run out of cartridges at this rate <laughs> uh, stay So end of the drive, got to work the dogs, so they put a bunch of dummies out just in between us and the trees out here uh, and then we work the dogs out, picking up, coming back. We've got a nice little pile. After we had filled up with a delicious lunch in the sun, we had a few minutes to spare to admire the beautiful scenery we were surrounded by before thinking about the next drives. Drives 3 and 4 were based at the bottom of a large hill with the traps launching the tiny clays well above our heads, just like driven pheasants. This was by far the most exciting drive and really good fun to shoot, so let's not waste any more time, watch the action. So I'm here today with Andy from Cotswolds Field Sports and Cotswolds Gun Dogs uh, and they've kind of teamed up today uh, and they've given us this simulated day with a bit of a twist. So Andy, do you want to just explain kind of what you do here? Yeah, so basically what we do is we do uh, a simulated day that involves clay. So if you've got a peg dog, you can come and shoot with a peg dog, shoot some clays, get it ready for the season. If you've got a new peg dog, you can introduce it to guns by being at the back first and getting closer. Or if you're a picker, you can come pick it at the back and basically just simulate a shoot day. So it's as close as we can get it without yeah. code game, basically. So I've been here all day. I've done drives, partridge drives. I've done pheasant drives and they've been fucking hard to hit <laughs> and pretty damn high. We've had the dog all day and they kind of really hammer home that it's a, like a safe space to make your errors. Um, you can really kind of have some fun here without the pressure of like a usual game day. And I think it's a really good way to get people involved. Um, so thank you very much, I'll have yep. an awesome day. Yep. Thanks for inviting me yep. <laughs> and, and we'll definitely be back. So if anyone does want to come, I recommend it. Cotswold Field Sports or Cotswold's Gun Dogs on Instagram, uh, Facebook and I imagine everywhere else. <laughs> yeah, yeah, really good. Yeah.